Rules of Divisibility. 3. We know how to tell if 2 is a factor of any given number, and 5 and 10. Those are the easy ones we can tell at a glance. The way we know if a number is evenly divisible by 3 or not, without actually doing a division problem, that's a bit different. That has a trick to it. Let's start off with something you know already, the 3 times table. I want you to notice something cool with these double digit answers. Watch what happens when I split them up, then add them. With 12, we say 1 plus 2 is 3. 15, 1 plus 5 is 6. 18, 1 plus 8 is 9. 21, 2 plus 1, 3. 24, 2 plus 4, 6. 27, 2 plus 7, 9. And on, and on, and on. Check out that pattern. 3, 6, 9, 3, 6, 9, 3, 6, 9. And the really cool thing is, this method works with any number. You just add up each of its digits and repeat until you get down to a single digit answer. If it's a 3, 6 or 9, you know that 3 is a factor. No division required. That's a handy trick and a time saver for everyone. Let's do an example and see how it works. Is 82 evenly divisible by 3? Split up 82 and add the digits. 8 plus 2 is 10. We know 10 is not divisible by 3, and using the adding method, 1 plus 0 is 1. It doesn't work. 83 won't work either, because 8 plus 3 is 11, which is not divisible by 3, and using the adding method, 1 plus 1 is 2. But 84 will work. 8 plus 4 is 12. We know 12 is divisible by 3, 4 3s are 12, and using the adding method, 1 plus 2 is 3. Remember, if the answer is 3, 6 or 9, the number is divisible by 3, it has got 3 as a factor. Is 267 evenly divisible by 3? Split it up to add the digits. 2 plus 6 plus 7. The order we add numbers doesn't make a difference, so I add it up in a way that makes sense to me. 6 plus 7 is 13, plus 2 is 15. And from 15, we say 1 plus 5 is 6. So 267 is evenly divisible by 3. It has got 3 as a factor. Last one. 8,460. Is it divisible by 3? Split it up to add the digits. 8 plus 4 plus 6 plus 0. 4 and 6 is 10. Plus 8 is 18. And I can just ignore the 0. And from 18, 1 plus 8 is 9. So yeah, we know it is divisible. 3 is a factor. Cool or what? Next up, you know you are going to practice some of these. First, quickly find out if the numbers are divisible by 3. Show your addition work horizontally like I did. Try to make it fast and easy by grouping the numbers together in ways that make sense to you. Step 2 is to do all the divisions. Make this trick part of you, then amaze your friends and family with your new math knowledge. Then share the trick. Everybody should know this stuff.